Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and the next video is going to be about, this is the second part of uh, closing two nodes on two different paths. So I, I redrew my item from the other video so I could be a little bit, maybe you could see a little bit better, but you could see we got two different paths here, and we're going to select them both. Well, I'll tell you what we're going to do this time. We're going to take our nudge factor to 0.5 inches, a half of an inch. We're going to select both these, go up to object, join curves, and look what it's done. It's already, it's showing us a blue line. I don't know if you can see that on the, your, your monitor at home, but it's showing us a blue line that our gap tolerance is enough. It's going to make it. Then you just hit apply and it, it closes the node. But let's back up here and that's with using extended. Your chamfered. It's going to be the shortest distance between the two points. And here is fillet, which is a pretty cool effect that you probably would have trouble drawing. You know, and getting that perfect between those two. So it's a very useful tool when joining two objects in two different paths. And then just hit apply, and you've got it done. I mean, it's pretty cool and it's each node is connected to the other node that's not going to break apart anyway hope that helped a little bit and thank you for watching